Another day, another Walmart murder and mayhem at the mall. A manager at Walmart opens fire with an automatic weapon, killing and maiming dozens of people. Another day, another shoot-up of a gay nightclub, this time by a non-binary identifying assailant who calls himself MX. Who knows the mixture of mental illness and automatic weapons in the United States of America may prove to be an even bigger division and diversion from normal life in the country than the politicians themselves. How's Paul Pelosi doing, by the way? Nancy is stepping down. It's a decent alternative to falling down, much of which she has been doing over these last years, whilst Paul amassed probably a billion dollars in stock market trading. He has proved remarkably clairvoyant on how the stock market in the US was going to develop. Another day, another disaster in the Kharkov region of Ukraine, where the Nazi Kraken Battalion helpfully photographed the civilians that they had lined up and murdered, laying them out like victims of the Nazi Holocaust in the East, on which, of course, their forefathers were on the Nazi side. 80% of Kiev is now without water and power. How's the war in Ukraine going? You know, the one that you were told when you were told about it at all, that Ukraine was winning. And it's been quite a week for hypocrisy in Doha in Qatar. Fasten your seatbelts. It's going to be a bumpy night, as Betty Davis once said.